Hello everyone. Multisoft welcomes you all to a session on PHP that is a popular web programming language. The session will throw light on the background and features of the language, related certification along with its scope in today's market scenario. Multisoft offers core PHP online training at your doorstep. It teaches PHP from the basics with the help of real life examples through cutting edge topics leading to the certification. It will be ideal for candidates with computer science background who aim to become successful PHP developers. Let's start with the agenda. I will begin with the foundation of the PHP language, which will include the background, features and history associated with it. Next will be a brief about Zen Technologies, that is the owner of PHP. Further, I'll move on to the certification details and we'll then discuss about the course details that will comprise the professional scope, target audience, prerequisites and the course outline. The next section will be sneak preview where I'll briefly explain one of the important course topics. This will give you a fair understanding about how online training will happen at Multisoft. I will then move on to the Multisoft Core PHP online training section where you'll come to know about the training deliverables. At last, I'll summarize the session for you. Let's now investigate about the basics of PHP. Starting with the background, which builds the foundation of PHP, PHP is a recursive acronym for PHP Hypertext Preprocessor. It is a widely used open source general purpose scripting language that is especially suited for web development and can be embedded into HTML. It is a server side scripting language and scripts are executed on the server. Also, it supports many databases. Another feather to its cap is that it is an open source software and is free to download. Moving on to its features, PHP has quite easy syntax if you are familiar with any C type language. Also, it has all the same structures familiar with other programming languages and is designed to provide output to the browser along with command line interface capability. To add on, this programming language is quite rich with its history. It was created in 1994 and was initially developed for HTTP usage, logging and server-side form generation in Unix. In 1995, it became PHP 2 with some added features such as the language was transformed into server-side embedded scripting language and database support, file uploads, variables, arrays and recursive functions were added. In 1998, it became PHP 3 and support for ODBC data sources, multiple platform support, email protocols were added along with addition of new parser by Zeev Zuraski and Andy Gutmans. In 2000, PHP 4 turned into an independent component of the web server because of added efficiency and parser was renamed as Zend Engine. PHP 5 is the current version with object-oriented programming and a dozen of new features added to Zen Engine 2. Learning about PHP would be incomplete without having the knowledge about Zen Technologies that is the owner of PHP language. Zen Technologies Limited is a worldwide web infrastructure software company with headquarters in California, US. It has offices in various other locations. The company's operations are currently centered on the development of products relating to the development, deployment and management of PHP-based web applications, including Zen Studio. It provides a number of products such as Zen Server, Community Edition, Zen Platform, Zen Studio, Zen Guard and Zen Certification Test. Zen offers certifications after evaluating your skills. So let us have a look at the certification for which we fulfill the eligibility criteria after completing the PHP online training. Zen certifications are the industry standard for validating an individual's skill and expertise in PHP. Zen exams are offered through more than 4000 Pearson View testing centers worldwide. After completing this core PHP training offered by Multisoft, aspirants acquire the skills required to pass the PHP exam. Successfully clearing the same makes individuals Zen-certified PHP engineers. 
course details is the next indispensable section that I'm going to discuss with you. This will cover the target audience, prerequisites, scope for PHP developers and the course outline. The target audience for this course include beginners with an experience of less than 6 to 12 months in software development who aim to learn the basics of the PHP language and students with computer science background. Web designers who aim to build their foundation in the basics of professional web programming and want to become PHP developers are also the ideal members for this course. Further talking about the prerequisites, individuals must be aware about the basic concepts of C and C++ language, object-oriented principles, database concepts and structured query language syntax. Those who have expertise with the PHP programming language have huge benefits to receive as their career progresses. The average earnings of PHP developers is around $59,000 in the United States. PHP developers are also subject to various employee benefits like bonuses and have higher chances of moving up the ladder in terms of their designation. Additionally, the Bureau of Labor Statistics projects 3,67,900 jobs for web developers to be created by 2020. In the PHP online training at Multisoft, we will cover the modules shared on the slide in detail. So, are you full with the valuable information about PHP language? Well, it is time we get into some depth about a particular topic of this course. I will now enlighten you with the most awaited and informational section, that's the sneak preview. We will start with the basics of web programming concepts. Let us first know about tire. Each tire or layer should have the ability of being constructed separately, possibly by different teams of people with different skills. When we use the term the web, we mean three major distinct standards and the tools based on these standards. The hypertext markup language, that is HTML, the hypertext transfer protocol, that's HTTP, and the TCP IP networking protocol suit. HTML works well for structuring and presenting information using a web browser application. TCP IP is an effective networking protocol that transfers data between applications over the internet and has little impact on web database application developers. Further moving on with it, the three-tire architecture provides a conceptual framework for web database applications. The web itself provides the protocols and network that connect the client and middle tires of the application. That is, it provides the connection between the web browser and the web server. HTTP is one component that binds together the three-tire architecture. Server-side programming is writing code that runs on the server using languages supported by the server. The server is the party that's responsible for serving pages. The client is the party that requests pages from the server and displays them to the user. In most cases, the client is a web browser. The user is the one who uses the client in order to serve the web, fill in forms, watch videos online, etc. Further talking about the client-side techniques, any language running on a client device that interacts with a remote service is referred to as client-side language. Client-side programming is writing code that will run on the client and is done in languages that can be executed by the browser such as JavaScript. A web application framework is a software framework that is designed to support the development of dynamic websites, web applications and web services. Also, numerous frameworks are available for many languages. So that's the end of the sneak preview section. I'm sure you enjoyed learning the concepts I shared with you. It's time we move on to the PHP online training section where I'll discuss with you the training deliverables. When you register with us for the training, we will connect with you as per the pre-decided time and embark training for 24 hours in all. For the exact schedule and each session's duration, 
you can refer to the training calendar on our website. The training happens through a secure web conferencing tool that allows a real-time learning experience. Once you register with us, we send out event links to you wherein you log into a collaborative platform that allows two-way interaction between the student and the trainer through webcam and voice chat. It is as good as a classroom since the whiteboard allows the trainer to transfer knowledge as done in a classroom. The share option lets the experts share files, applications, videos and even desktops. Once you register with us, we provide you 24 by 7 access to an online resource center wherein apart from accessing other training material, you can also attempt 6 assignments and 8 assessments. Apart from these two valuable exam-oriented resources, you also get access to all related presentations and training videos. This is a sample of the online assessment that will test your knowledge on the various course concepts. All the questions will have four options, out of which you need to select the correct one. At the end of the assessment, you'll get the information on the correct answers and reasoning behind the same. Now to summarize the session, this will be a 24 hours instructor-led online training that will be conducted by an experienced instructor. In addition, you will get 24 by 7 access to the learning management system where you can attempt 6 assignments and 8 assessments. After the training, individuals will be eligible to appear for the foundation exam and gain the SEND certified PHP engineer certification. This session was an attempt to provide you detailed information about the online PHP training program. In order to register for the course or to ask any question, please write to us at info at